With the new beginnings, Niagara University welcomes a new president and science building. NFP TV took the time to speak with Niagara University's new president, Reverend James Marr. Uh, you know, employees here, in, in large measure, they really give their lives to the university and to its mission. And so when you have that level of commitment, um, it, it, it really means coming to a place that's not just work, but it's a place where people can actually feel like I'm making a difference, I'm living my mission, um, and um, and having a particularly important impact on young people, which is really the future. Reverend Mar has many plans for the future and believes that Niagara has many wonderful qualities to offer to the public. You know, we have a, a great experience here for learning, for living, for building community, and, and for building a future. And so I think that's a big, big part of, um, you know, what we'll be marketing. In addition to the arrival of a new president, the $28 million Thomas Golisano Center for the Integrated Sciences will be home to the chemistry, biology, and physics departments at Niagara. Well, it was about 17 years ago that the science departments said, we really need help. We really need better facilities for our students uh, in order to show off the wonderful work that they're doing with experiments and the research research that they're doing, the students working with faculty. So we started looking then at what the possibilities could be. Before is the way it's set up with biology on this side, chemistry on the other. The whole center of the building is support space. So you can see there's dry chemical storage, there's the restrooms are there, there's biology prep rooms. So everything in the center there and a lot of it is shared and that hence the term integrative sciences as they both work together, both of the departments. The brand new building allows students to interact with one another inside and outside of the classroom with the use of interactive touch screens and various technologies. Find more news at www.wnypapers.com.